Hello again, this is JC from Real and Simulated Wars and I'm going to present today yet another combat mission Cold War vignette. You remember this scenario was a matter of my uh, previous uh, video and as you remember we have used the small screen to uh, treat the extremely sharp uh, spearhead of the Russians. We more or less succeeded and this is time that we are retiring there were some vehicle losses and my one of my trooper teams had to had to walk back to the friendly lines this is showing the perspective with the background you see the extreme pressure in the three line they're trying to get there and this is the precise moment where this event happens one of my troopers falls victim to shrapnel or something the pressure on the tree line was really very great and unfortunately a few minutes later the Russians shifted their artillery fire from the tree line all the way to the village which is their first objective that uh, can be seen in this sequence of events and that uh, you know relieves a bit of pressure on the tree line and uh, gave me the thought of maybe manning it and start defending from it that's gonna be shown in, in in the next video but you know I felt guilty about that trooper falling so I kept the other fellow troopers over there for rescuing him and uh, well I made some mistakes too I tried to reinforce this uh, tree line trying to probe it I sent this dragon uh, vehicle dragon missile vehicle uh, to the tree line I failed to consider and to ponder the hold down position and it gets immediately pummeled like boom there it goes no more but nonetheless here is the sequence where the victim it is being treated and uh, it will be subsequently med vacated to the to the rear lines that was a success in my view you see the you can hear the thuds that's an M1 Abrams that they brought into a hold down position and it caught some targets started firing but there are so many Russian vehicles up front that I'm thinking about I'm very concerned about you know ammunition because it's hitting you know IFBs when it could have be actually targeting tanks but nonetheless I just took this man behind uh, back to friendly lines and that made me very very happy so sorry for the short video there is a lot going on in the world of wargaming and uh, where I'm gonna be catching up thank you very much for watching